supporters of the Jamaat ad dawa Islamist organization have taken to the streets of Pakistan's eastern city of Lahore to protest against U.S. drone strikes against militants in the northwest of the country. Protesters held party flags and placards, including one reading, shoot down drones, let peace prevail. The issue of drone strikes against militants is extremely sensitive in Pakistan, where many see them as a breach of Pakistani sovereignty, which causes too many unintended casualties. According to estimates, since 2004, some 360 drone attacks have been carried out in Pakistan, killing more than 2,000 militants, but also between 400 to 800 civilians. Amnesty International has said that because some victims are unarmed, some strikes could amount to war crimes. Most recently, a drone strike by the United States on the 21st of November struck a religious seminary believed to be connected with the Taliban-linked Haqqani network. It killed a senior member of the organization, along with four other unidentified people. Those opposed to U.S. drone strikes have also been holding sit-ins to block the NATO supply route that passes into Afghanistan. The PTI party of Imran Khan controls one of the two main Pakistani border points, where officials say nearly 70% of supplies for thousands of foreign troops in Afghanistan are transported. Pakistan's new top general, Raheel Sharif, will be faced with the challenge of getting U.S. aid back on track while tackling the thorny issue of drones. Between 2002 and 2011, some 18 billion U.S. dollars in military and economic aid was earmarked for Pakistan by the U.S., but aid was slashed due to diplomatic issues between the U.S. and Pakistan, including the issue of drone strikes.